So this is the very first question I saw in my uh, paper. Any non-zero real number x, y such that y is not equal to 3 and x upon y is less than x plus 3 upon y minus 3 will satisfy the condition. Now, uh, I think guys, the best way to answer like this question is to use the options here. The first option A tells you that y is greater than 10. If y is greater than 10, then minus x will be greater than y. We need to validate this first of all. Okay. So take any value of y more than 10. Let's take y is equal to uh, 12 for that matter. Okay. So y is equal to 12 should basically give you minus x greater than 12 or multiplying by minus one on both sides, you should get X less than minus 12 when you solve. Okay. Whenever we multiply by something negative, the inequality will change on both sides. Right. So I'll have randomly taken Y is equal to 12, some value more than 10. And I multiplied by minus one on both sides. So inequality gets reversed. This is what I should get. So substituting Y is equal to 12 in the equation, I must get X is less than minus 12. If this happens then option A is the answer, otherwise it's option B, C or D. So let's check, put Y equals to 12. You will get X upon 12 is less than X plus three divided by 12 minus three. 12 minus three becomes nine. So three and three will get canceled four here and three here. Next step is we'll cross multiply. So three into X will come here, three into X and four into X plus three will be four X plus four threes are 12. So three X is less than four X plus 12. And that's why we are getting three X minus four X minus X is less than 12. But if I multiply this inequality, both sides by minus one, I will get X is greater than minus 12, but we want X is less than minus 12 to be true, right? Matlab, this is not correct. And hence the option A is not a correct answer possible. Okay. So we'll simply eliminate the option A. All right. Now something similar we'll do in the second option also, guys, if X is less than zero, then minus X should be less than Y. We must select a value for X guys. Let's take X is equal to minus two. Okay. Then we must get minus X to be less than Y. So minus of minus two will be less than Y. Minus of minus two is two, two less than Y. That tells you Y is greater than two. We must get this. Okay, so let's substitute X is minus two in this equation and check whether we get Y is greater than two. So X is like I'm putting minus two, minus two upon Y should be less than minus two plus three upon Y minus three. So minus two upon Y is less than one upon Y minus three. Let's uh, cross multiply. We have uh, one into Y or minus two into Y minus three to be less than Y. So we have minus two plus two threes are six. To be less than y just add 2y on both sides 6 should be less than 3y 3y greater than 6 or uh, 2 is less than y this is precisely what we wanted to figure out or find out right we, whether this is true yes it is true 2 is less than y and thereby we have found our correct answer it is the b option